All right, this is one of my favorite flies. King mackerel, Spanish mackerel, any of the mackerel that are busting the surface that I see when I'm offshore. I like to have a fly rod ready at all times when I'm running. A lot of times you run right into a school or right up to a school and you can make a cast. So I like to have one of these on the rod at all times. And this is basic lefty's deceiver. Uh, it's an old fly made a long time ago by, by lefty. I like to do mine kind of in a uh, cigar minute color. Using a number two mustad long shank hook. We're going to tie in our white polar fiber here. This is just some flash. I believe it's polar fiber. Get it in here where I want it. Make sure everything goes where I want it. Start off with some loose wraps. Make them a little tighter once you get everything in place. Of course, the deceiver fly is going to ride hook down. A little light material goes on the bottom. And come on top with some peacock curl. This is one of my favorite materials to, to use in fly tying. Really gives off a lot of flash, but not too much. The fish really seem to respond to it well. It gives that iridescent pattern just like a normal bait fish would. I put that in there. I'm going to throw in just a little bit more flash. I don't want much of this. I don't like putting too much flash into these flies. Maybe about four strands of some olive pearl right on top of here. On low wind conditions this is great. Sometimes when it's a little windy this will add a little bit more resistance to the fly than you like. You can always trim this olive pearl off of there. This will kind of come by you and you'll hear the distinctive flapping noise. And if you hear that and you don't like it, it's affecting the performance, you just trim it off. We're going to build up a nice little head here on this fly. It should be about plenty. Take a look at everything one last time. We're going to just do some whip finishes here. Trim it up. Come in with some head cement. And we're going to build up a little head here. This is the first part of the fly. The second part would be you can come back and put in some eyes on here, some stick on eyes, and then put a second coat. Or if you want to be just really quick about it, and you can just let this dry and dab it with a paint marker, dab some eyes on. Won't hold up quite as well, but get the job done just as easy. And that's a devastating fly there. King mackerel, Spanish mackerel, cobia even. Get a cobia interested. And every now and then maybe even a barracuda. But really it shines very good with king mackerel and Spanish mackerel. I like to have one of these tied on at all times. That's it. It's just a basic deceiver. A little bit of flash thrown in on the top. To imitate a cigar minute. Hope you like it. Works good for me.